are we about to die? No, we're about to vanish from this reality. That's totally dying. No, it isn't. It's everyone from this reality returning to their reality of origin. How did I end up not in my own universe? Oh my god, the Jerry Barry. Oh, oh, the, the Jerry Barry. Deep cuts. Wait, but where's our real dad and our real Morty? Buried in the backyard. That's what the possums are after. <laughs> sort of chemical thing happen inside of Jessica's mind? You know, so where she falls in love with me and all that sort of thing? This is called oxytocin. I just gotta combine it with some of your DNA. This is a chemical released in a mammal's brain that, you know, that makes it fall in love. Whoever you smear this stuff on will fall in love with you. And only you, forever. Is this pump bothering you, Jessica? Leave him alone, jerk! I'm in love with him! He is more man than you will ever be! That's you! There's no dangers or anything or side effects, right? Go nuts, Morty. It's foolproof. Unless she has the flu. I love you, Morty! What the hell is going on, Rick? What does it look like? The, 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 the serum is piggybacking on the virus. It's gone airborne, Morty. Oh, crap. What are we gonna do, Rick? It's gonna be fine, Morty. Relax. I whipped up an antidote. It's based on praying mantis DNA. They mate once and then they, you know, decapitate the partner. I mean, there's no love at all. It should neutralize the whole thing, Morty. The whole world is infected! Yeah, it's pretty wild how fast that spread. This right here is gonna do the trick, baby. It's koala mixed with rattlesnake, chimpanzee, cactus, shark, golden retriever, and just a smidge of dinosaur. Should add up to normal humanity. I don't, that doesn't make any sense, Rick! How does that add up to normal humanity? Boy, Morty, I really Cronenberg the world up, didn't I? We got a whole Whoa. planet of Cronenbergs walking around down there. You gotta fix this, Rick! All right, all right, Morty. You know, we, we, we are in a pretty deep hole here, but I do have one emergency solution that I can use that'll kind of put everything back to normal, relatively speaking. Wow, well, Rick, I gotta say, I, I really thought that the whole place was gonna be messed up for good, but... Here you did it. You, you 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 figured out that crazy solution like you always do. Whew. Will you hand me a screwdriver so I can finish my ionic defibrillator? Sure thing, Rick. Here's a screwdriver. All right, Morty. Thank you very much. We got one screw turn and two screw turns and. All right, Morty. Here we are. Oh my God, Rick. Is that us? We're dead. What is going on, Rick? I'm freaking out! Calm down, Morty! Look at me! Oh, calm God, down, Morty! No, I can't do it! You gotta calm, calm yourself, Morty! Morty, calm down, Morty! Morty, you gotta calm down, Morty! Morty, will you listen to me, Morty? Shut up and listen to me! It's fine! Everything is fine! There's an infinite number of realities, Morty! And in a few dozen of those, I got lucky and turned everything back to normal! I just had to find one of those realities in which we also happen to both die around this time! Now, we can just slip into the place of our dead selves in this reality, and everything will be fine! We're not skipping a beat, Morty. Now help me with these bodies. This is insane. Look, Morty, I'll grab myself. You grab yourself, okay? I mean, that, that, that seems fair to me. I mean, that seems like a fair way to divvy it up. Look on down from the bridge. It's still raining We got some business to attend to a few late minutes south of here. Oh, you still use south in space? Whoa! Jesus, Jerry! What the hell are you doing here? What are you talking about? We agreed a boy's father should be present when he's learning to drive. And you've just been back there this whole time? Well, we don't have time to take him to Earth, Morty. We head for 3924917. Jerry Burry? You created a daycare for my dad? Don't forget to check the reason for your drop-off. Trust me, Morty. I've heard stories from other Ricks. Jerry's don't tend to last five minutes off of Earth. This is a totally unregistered cross-temporal asteroid. Here, they can romp and play with other Jerry's. It couldn't be safer. Hey, Morty, hang on to this. That number's your dad. If you lose it, we're not gonna be able to get him back. Jerry, get out of here. 
Yeah, hey, Morty, there's our Jerry. Mm, I missed you. Hey, Rick. Glad you're safe, Jerry. What do you say we go home? I'd like that. Hey, wait, uh, do you have 5126? Uh, I'm not sure. Morty. Uh, that's a Blitz and Chits ticket. What? Way to go, Morty. Uh, whatever. Uh, wait, wait, what? Dad, I'm out of excuses to not be who I am. So, who am I? What do I do? My advice? Take off. Put a saddle on your universe. Let it kick itself out. I can't do that. The kids, Jerry, my job, and as much as I hate to admit it, ABC's The Bachelor. I can make a clone of you. A perfect instance of you with all your memories, an exact copy in every way. It'll love and provide for the kids, do your job, and consume broadcast network reality TV on the same allegedly ironic level as you. You could be gone a day, a week, or the rest of your life with zero consequences. The moment you decide to come back, I flip a switch, and the clone's job is done. It feels no pain, regrets nothing, and has zero chance of going Blade Runner. My superiors have some questions about the Defiance. I don't have a... I have a Defiance? Oh god, I'm a clone. Everybody in the car! You're not a clone. And who is that? Uh, uh, a clone? Why would you make a clone of me just to send the clone into space? Well, you didn't want to go, and I thought, okay, that's cool. But then I thought, well, you, you know what would be even cooler? Is a space daughter? So I made one. I'm tired of believing you. I want to talk to her. No, you don't. Jerry, do something! Hey! He told me you're the clone. What do you think he told me? You're the clone? Wow, naive and attractive. Wow, jaded and hot. You jerk-offs ready to get the answers to your burning questions? What's this, Dad? The memory of which Beth is real and which Beth is a clone, obviously. You mind blew yourself? You, you, you literally don't even know which of your daughters is real. Of course you don't. Why am I surprised? I'm sure you'd love for us to need that from you, but I don't care what's in that vial. Yeah, me neither. You're a piece of shit either way. So what, after all this, you, you don't want to know the truth? The truth is we have more important shit to do, like raise our kids and stamp out the Federation, neither of which seem like they want anything to do with you. <laughs> Morty, some some, you gotta at least want to know who your real mom is. Not really, Rick. We have two badass moms now. It's, that's kind of a win-win. Yeah, Grandpa Rick, don't drag us into your bullshit just because you're losing control. Portal travel's broken. I need to reboot the portal index immediately. Uh, oh. Oh, shit. Wait, what? Well, what's happening? Instead of resetting portal travel, I may have reset portal travelers. Too late to apologize. Rick, why am I pulsing green? And don't say you don't know, because you're pulsing green. Rick, are we about to die? No, we're about to vanish from this reality. That's totally dying. No, it isn't. It's everyone from this reality returning to their reality of origin. How did I end up not in my own universe? Oh my god, the Jerry Barry! Oh, oh the, the Jerry, Jerry Barry! Deep cut. Maybe I wouldn't be so uptight if I wasn't married to an unemployed receptacle of human fear. Get a job, Dad. It's been a decade. Oof, pretty brutal, Jer. I, I know a good alligator park if you want to kill yourself. I got expelled today. What the oh, hell, no, Morty? You, you got, got expelled? expelled? Whoa, you are so fucking thing. dumb. Bad, Hi, hon. Oof, some real season two vibes in there, you know what I'm saying? You know, never thought I'd say this, but I think I'm glad we spent that time divorced. Uh, one second. What the hell, Morty? the backyard! You know, I may technically be from here, but I'm a goddamn interdimensional traveler now, and all of you can kiss my sci-fi ass. What an adventure! You know, I guess it doesn't matter where we're from if we're together, huh? This is everyone's original dimension now. Great wrap-ups, kids. Ugh, you're back. Oh shit, season two, Jerry! Look, before you bust my balls, can someone help with this shower? It's colder than Beth on our anniversary. Also, look who I found in Rick's room. Mm. I'm Mr. Frundles. I don't care how cute he is. We agreed. No boogans in the house. Wait, season two, Jerry, don't. Oh, whoa. Mr. Frundles. Everybody in the car. Mm, I'm Mr. Frundles. Wait, but I thought he was Mr. Frundles. Everybody in the car, now. Mm, I'm Mr. Mm, Frundles. I'm Mr. Frundles. We gotta find a new timeline now. Can't we just go back and fix it? 
I can't believe Portal Travel's broken. I'll get to it when I get to it. Lift with your knees, Mom! How many times have you done this? Oh, God. And you swear they die of natural causes? Mm-hmm, yep. The exact same as our old timeline? Even my stuff? Bit of a rush job, actually, so they do say Parmesan weird. How do they say? Parmesan. I could have left you guys. You think the concept of family matters to me? I'm not even your Rick. Uh -huh. I'm denial See you inside, Rick. Dad. Parmesan. 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 Gross. Yeah. I hate it.